In this video, I'll show you how to import a sequence of images into Shotcut and have it be converted into just a video. So to do this, we have a sequence of images here. If I just push forward, this is just looking at them in the picture viewer. And what we need to do is just drag and drop the very first image of the sequence uh, into our playlist area. So you'll have, just need to click on playlist and then drag that in. And then while that's selected, click on properties. If you don't have a properties tab, you can also get to it by clicking properties up here. And then we just check this checkbox next to image sequence. And this says how many pictures do you want per frame? Uh, this is only a 20 frame um, movie, but I'll just say one. You could, if you wanted to go slower, you could have more play, but then we just click and it'll play through very quickly, or we can hold and click and look through at those. And then once that's done, if we go back to our playlist, that's now converted, we can left click and drag it down to the timeline. And now our video is here in the timeline and we can zoom in since it's very, very small. And we can see that whole video here. If we wanna just export this short video now, we could leave it just like this. If we're not doing any more edits, we can just click up on export and then we can click on YouTube. If we wanna export for YouTube, for example, click export file and then give it a name. We'll just call this test. Uh, under uh, videos and hit save. Oh. We'll just call this test and then click save and that will export. Shouldn't take long at all with a tiny video like this. And now that video is done and then if we go into the videos uh, on my computer where I saved that, we now have a, a folder called test Oh, oh, I put it in a folder called test, uh, and uh, also I already had a folder called test. But now we have this video, and uh, there it is, a video from an image sequence. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. Appreciate you watching. We'll catch you in the next video.